Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is December the 27, 2021. I'm going to do a price prediction today in the market for Roblox. Yeah, I want you all to see what I am noticing on the price chart so we won't be scared, we won't be nervous in regarding where a market is going to go. We can actually get in position and win. Yeah, we can. And I want to show you all that today for Roblox. So make sure you guys appreciate the videos. If you do, hit the like button. You know, share the video. Also, subscribe here to the channel. I make this simple and easy. I'm not here to confuse you because I understand that there's a lot of confusion already going on in the market for these stocks. I mean, at one point, you have YouTubers telling you to pay attention to the tentacles. You got other YouTubers telling you to pay attention to the fundamentals. And then you got other YouTubers telling you to pay attention to what the Fed does in terms of inflation. Then you got some other YouTubers to telling you all to pay attention to some tweets that some influential individual is tweeting. And then you got some individuals telling you to look at the astrological signs of the stars. And then you got some individuals telling you to pay attention to how you feel in the morning to make a determination as to whether the stock is going to go up or go down. It's a lot of confusion out there. But from my realm, this channel, we only focus in on the money. We only focus in on the price and price alone. Money talks, but the noise walks. We don't put that in here. All right. So let me show you all this today in Roblox. Check this out. Now, we saw a pretty good run in Roblox recently. Yeah, we have. I mean, look at this. The marketing Roblox from November the 8th. 2021 all the way until November 22nd went up 84% massive right cool well since November the 8th I mean November 22nd right we've lost 25% of that value so now do you think Roblox is a buy right here or are we going to continue to expect some movement to the downside one thing I want you all to pay attention to, if you're new to our channel, I've been telling all of my subscribers is that volume is the lifeblood of the market. OK, the volume tells us how active the market was, who came in and participated and who didn't. This right here. This volume right here tells us that a lot of the big money was involved in Roblox price action. Yeah, I mean, it stands out at you, doesn't it? This market has been dry in Roblox, maybe in since, you know, uh, May time frame. This is dry compared to, to what we've seen recently. So what's been going on? Have they been buying? Have they been selling? I want you all to look at this as well. Look at this volume bar right there. Okay, let me show it to you. You see that? What happened to the market after this particular day? Did the market continue to fall? I mean, answer the question. Did the market fall following this high volume trading day, December the 15th? No, it didn't. So what does it mean? Well, it tells us that we found the basis of where support is. This is where the buyers are at in the market in Roblox. It's simple. Now, we've already established that we can see that the market buyers came in Roblox right here around ninety three dollars. Just pretty much the same thing of what we did back in November. Hmm. Like I said, the answers are already on the chart. Now, as long as Roblox price stays above ninety-three dollars, ninety-two give or take, we're gonna play sideways trading, right? I'm not gonna be massively bullish, but I understand that we got a support area. Okay, we found that. So if anything, we can expect the market to continue to bounce. Now we got the support for the lower end bounce area. Now we need to figure out, okay, where's the high? Where are the sellers at then? And Roblox. So let's see this on a five hour time frame. Can you see where the sellers are at? I mean, do you think they're here? At 110? Yeah, they could be. There might be some selling start right there. Do you think they're here? Do you see where the sellers are at? Where do you think the location is that is going to reject price going up and the market starting to come down? Do you think it's at 110? I mean, 109, 113, maybe even 120. I mean, what do you see? Because at one of these price levels, the sellers are there. 
and right before they start their selling we want to make sure we grab the bag before the market comes back down so I am looking for the price in robots to go up but I'm looking around like 110 and like I said maybe around 113 114 and then lastly 120 okay Yeah, I'm definitely gonna pay attention to this area though, 110. My eyes are definitely seeing that as an area of selling. Okay. Then I'm looking around like 114. And then 120. So let me show you how we ended on the five day time frame in the market of Roblox, because it kind of tells us how high this market is gonna go, right? So I really wanted to pay attention to that 110 though. Because we did see some strength into the market on this last five day price bar, which is why the market currently still getting a strength today on this current five day. This is the weekly time frame. See, I want you all to understand that this market is not massively bullish. Because right here on this weekly bar right here, you guys can see that we closed off of the highs, which tells me that there's still selling going on. Now, in the next week, which is this week, if we're able to see the market close at the high, then it definitely tells me that the market bought right here on this weekly time frame this anticipates will be for the price to continue to go up though okay this is the threes time frame and this is another reason why i'm not massively bullish in roblox price because of what happened on this last three weekly price bar and you guys can see where the market closed and opened on these three uh three weekly price bars this is where i'm expecting the selling to start which is why I really want us to pay attention to that $110 spot because we can really see the market and start selling there. Okay. But so far, the market in Roblox is pretty strong though. So let me go ahead and run the play. I want to confuse you all. Hopefully that was simplistic in what I said and, and what I've shown you because I want you all to realize that the answers are already here and there's no need for us to come out and try to reinvent the wheel. The market has already talking. Every time the market trades on a tradable day, it is speaking to us and we just need to come in and pay attention to what it's trying to say. So I'm looking for the price in Roblox to go up. I got 110 first. I mean, if we're able to see the market in Roblox really break 110, then yeah, maybe 114, then 120 is definitely a likely spot for us to see the market go in Roblox. So that's the first spot though, 110. Pay attention to the price action in Roblox around 110. I mean, that would give us what, 4% there? And then my next spot is like 114. That gives us around 7.5%. Then the third ultimate spot, if we're able to really maintain the buying, is around 120, which gives us around 13.65%. So I have given you all my three price targets in relation to Roblox um, compared to what I've seen on the price chart with the volume, how the buyers came in around $94. Yeah, I'm looking for the price to go up. All right. So real quick, like I said, money talks, noise walks. I want you all to draw me a price prediction as to what do you think the money is trying to tell you? Where is it trying to go? Leave me a price prediction real quick. Make sure you maintain a profitability and as always, trade different.